Reflections on the Revolution in France is a political treatise written by the British statesman and philosopher Edmund Burke in 1790. The book is a response to the French Revolution, which had begun the previous year, and argues against the revolutionary principles of liberty, equality, and fraternity. Here is a summary of some of the key ideas in the book. Burke begins by arguing that the French Revolution represents a dangerous departure from the traditions and institutions of France. He contends that the revolutionaries are motivated by a dangerous and misguided enthusiasm for abstract principles, rather than a genuine concern for the welfare of the French people. Burke also argues that the French Revolution is a threat to the stability and prosperity of Europe as a whole. He believes that the revolutionaries are attempting to impose their ideology on other countries, and that this will lead to chaos and violence. Burke criticizes the revolutionary idea of natural rights, arguing that such rights are illusory and that they can only be realized through the existence of established social institutions and traditions. Burke also emphasizes the importance of the rule of law and the need for a strong and stable government. He argues that the French Revolution has weakened the authority of the government and the traditional social order, and that this will ultimately lead to anarchy and violence. Burke also criticizes the revolutionaries for their attacks on religion and the church. He believes that the church plays an important role in maintaining social order and morality, and that the revolutionary assault on religion is a threat to the very foundations of civilized society. Finally, Burke emphasizes the importance of tradition and history in shaping society. He argues that the revolutionaries have attempted to erase the past and create a completely new social order based on their own abstract principles, but that this is both impossible and dangerous. Overall, Reflections on the Revolution in France is a passionate defense of traditional social institutions and an attack on the revolutionary principles of the French Revolution. Its ideas have had a significant impact on subsequent conservative thought and continue to be studied and debated to this day.